Okay, so now that we have our, our question set up, our default question, right? This is our, our basic quiz. It looks good, right? We have our question and we have the, uh, the, the choices, select each choice, and we get a little bit of feedback here for both the incorrect and correct feedback, but we're really not uh, designing this course. This is really more of the template look. We want to actually go beyond this default setting and create something that looks and feels a lot more custom, as well as align it with the visuals to our course. To do that, we're going to need to do some formatting and customization here for our uh, question. And to do that, we're going to need to enter slide view. So I'm going to open up this first question right here. And we're going to move into slide view, right? So whenever we want to do more, whenever we want to really create more custom quizzes in QuizMaker, we're going to want to move into slide view. So we just jump one button over and click slide view. And then from here, we can customize our background. Couple different ways we can do that. But one of the fastest ways really is, since we're really going to work with only one theme here, is we can just format the background. So I can click anywhere around here and select format background. And over here, I don't want to do a, uh, a solid or gradient fill. I actually want to work with a picture or texture fill. So I select picture or texture. And let's go ahead and find our background image. All right, so open the image folder. And here's our background. Just double click it. And it fills up our background. Let's go ahead and click apply to all. And that'll also work for any new slides we create. Click close. So a couple things here. We could change our default text styles and make everything a lot lighter. However, we're going to add the tabs down here. So we don't, we may not want to change our color scheme yet. Uh, the title text, yes, we're going to want that to be lighter because that's not going over anything but the background. But for the tabs and our questions, we actually are going to put these over a, uh, a lighter tab color. So rather than changing our color scheme, which we could easily do by coming up to the colors, I'm just going to change the title text to a, uh, an off-white. Now, again, it just depends on where you want to uh, put your color themes, what you want to apply. I want to keep these tabs actually working from our default colors, which is the darker colors. So if I went into the colors real quick and I bring in Office, I can open this up. My default text color is going to be black on the light, and then it's going to be whiter on a black background. So I'm going to keep everything I have uh, set up here. When I insert the tabs, I'm actually going to get all that. 